Is the series over? Yeah, it's over. Uh, obviously, we all predicted a, a, a fair, relatively easy Lakers victory in this series. But I, I got to be honest, I'd be lying if I sat here and said I saw them being up 32 points in game one. I thought it would be competitive. Even as I picked the Lakers in five, I thought for the most part the games would be competitive. I thought they win last night by nine or ten points or maybe even a little bit less. But it was a route, and if the other guys support AD and LeBron, who they've got nobody to stop, I mean, it's just there's no chance for the Heat. We talked earlier about the rebounding. Look at Bam out of Bayou. First of all, is he really a legit 6'9"? But <laughs> even so, even if he is, he's, he's not skinny, but he's small. Look at him compared to LeBron. Yep. LeBron's not only probably taller, but he's much bigger, much sturdier. Same with Dwight Howard and AD and, and all these guys. And if the injuries, Goran Dragic, him being out now, we all know plantar fasciitis. I've seen what that's done to players and even players' careers. A plantar tear really sounds painful and sounds problematic. So he may be done for the rest of the series. And if that's the case, I mean, he is their primary decision maker he is their quarterback on the floor. He's been having a great season. Uh, that's a huge loss. He's obviously one of their more experienced guys. And then, bam, if the shoulder's bothering him, it's tough enough to bang with the Lakers bigs when you're healthy. But if the shoulder's a problem, then he's really going to be compromised. And as much as we like Tyler Hero and Duncan Robinson and these guys, they are, at least at this stage of their career, and Duncan probably his whole career will be like this. But they are they're very good playing off other guys, right? Like, so when the game plan is to focus on Jimmy Butler, Bam, Goran Dragic, then Hero and Duncan can shine. They're not ready. Duncan Rock or uh, Hero was playing high school ball two years ago. They are not ready to be the focal point of a defense where the game plan is to stop you, and if Drogic is out and Bam is compromised, then that's who's next after Jimmy Butler. So the Heat, man, I think they're going to play more zone, try to just force the other guys from the Lakers to shoot threes and see if they can keep making them. But that's about their only hope. I agree with you. Um, deep down inside, I really thought the Lakers would win in five, but I said six because I was superstitious. And we kept it going because I picked them to beat Portland in six. I picked them to beat Houston in six. I picked them to beat the Nuggets in six. But I don't skip. It's hard for me to see them winning more than a game because the margin of error is so small for the Heat. It's as small as they are in size. So I don't see them how they win more than a game. Skip, if you look at this, Chris, Miami in the three games, they, in three games against the Bucks, they hit 17 threes. Well, if you hit numbers like that, Skip, you got an excellent chance. But you're going to have to do that. That's what it's going to take. And you're going to have to keep the Lakers off the glass. But like you said, because the Lakers are so big and they can, now they, they start Dwight. Dwight had more rebounds, had eight rebounds. That's, more than, that's two more than anybody on the uh, Heat had. Then you throw in AD's nine, you throw in LeBron's 13, and you throw in Kuzma's eight. How you, how, how, who's going to get rebounds for him? If Bam is compromised, he's really your only rebounder to begin with. He's the only guy of size to begin with. So if he can't bang with Dwight and he can't bang with AD and he can't keep LeBron off the glass, and then on the flip side, I don't care what defense you play. They have no answer for AD. You going to put Jay Crowder on him? Really? Or you going to put Iggy on him? Bam is too small. He can get whatever he wants. And LeBron James being the point guard that he is, and Rondo, they get to the crease of the defense. You come. They dish the AD. He's dunking it. They pass the wide open guys, and they were making threes last night. The margin of error is so small for the Miami Heat. If they're not making somewhere between 15 and 23s, Skip, I don't see how this game, I don't see how it goes more than five. And I can see if they don't win tomorrow night, I mean, yeah, tomorrow night, I don't see how it goes more than four. Mm. So, allow me to say of my man across the table, Shannon Sharp, the reason he predicted that the Heat would win two games in this series is because he was trying to legitimize the Heat 
as worthy competition for LeBron James. And Shannon, it was a feeble attempt. It did not work. Skip, they still, but you don't. You they know. are not legitimate competition. See, you, you try to delegitimize. I, I would like to adjust Skip, my don't prediction. You, let, don't you think? Don't you think LeBron? Though, I mean, he kind of deserves this. He's had to go through some. Go to some, state. Some juggernauts, or face some juggernauts, I should say. Well, he say. didn't go through them. He um, got gone yeah, through. this is kind of a, a pro. Yeah. Okay, so he, he needed a gimme, and he got a gimme, right? A little get, freebie. Going to get a couple more, too. Oh, is well, he? Well, getting through the West wasn't a gimme, though. Getting through the West was tough. Well, it, it was a gimme after the Clippers fell on their Oh, you mean Kawhi? I mean, you mean, I mean, uh, Kawhi? I mean, uh, I mean, Kawhi? Yep. Oh, my oh, bad. Oh, is that... The new no, no, no. I ain't yeah. say nothing, Skip. I ain't say nothing. Hey, he up there getting up shots. He in the lab. Remember his trainer? His trainer say he was in the lab, mm -hmm. and somebody was pretending. You know, he was on vacation. He got time. Remember, Skip? He got time. Mm -hmm. One guy was in the lab. One guy talking about being in the lab. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got time. How much time you got now? <laughs> now, back to the mismatch we're having to watch right now. I'm, I'm about to adjust my prediction <laughs> to Lakers in two. <laughs> Because I believe the next game will be such a blowout that both teams will vote after the game because they are sick and tired of being stuck bubble. in the bubble. They'll just say, let's just forget about the last two games because we want to go home. And home they will be home, James, because it will be time for the parade here, led by Shannon Sharp, who will be driving the lead car in the parade we in downtown Los Angeles. We're having a virtual parade. Yep. But I'm driving up, they're going to have the Lakers lined up. Everybody's in their car just blowing the horn. <laughs> okay. So th these are fairly mysterious injuries to me, Chris, because you mentioned the plantar tear. They're saying that Dragic has a plantar tear. It's, it runs underneath it's your foot. Sheet. And it is extremely painful just to have the tendonitis in it called yeah. plantar fasciitis. Mm -hmm. But... I don't know how they quickly diagnosed a plantar tear without an MRI unless it was a hands-on exam where right. it just said the doctor They could said, feel it, I guess. Yeah, like, okay. Well, but they also said after the game that a number of the Heat players were, were hopeful he would suck it up and try to play on it. I don't think you can play on it. No. I'm sorry. <laughs> and then Bam keeps hurting what looks like his wrist, and he grabs his wrist, oh, and he's just in anguish, but they say it's, it's a, a shoulder. shoulder strain. Okay, I don't really get that, but he bounced back against Boston and right. played. So, but think about it, he stayed in the game against Boston, Skip, and when he did that uh, the other night. He, this but time, this time he was he, out. He was gone. He, he went was straight gone to the, locker, to the room. locker room. I just don't know if he's going to be available. And the guy I thought was hurt was Jimmy Butler because he turned his ankle completely over. He did, and he sucked it up and kept going. He did not look a hundred percent on it. Right. But is it going to swell and and just cause him issues right. over the next forty eight hours? Probably. So I just say a mismatch just got got humiliatingly worse because they could be down three players. Well, I'm just hopeful when we come in here on Monday that we up 3-0. 3-0? That's what I'm hoping. Well, why, why wouldn't you be? Yeah, up 3-0, shake and bake, do what we he do on Sunday. Go ahead, Chris. We need at least Butler and Bam to play. I mean, if can you imagine if... No. Dragic and then one of the Bam is out. I mean, God. Yeah. Me, this I, will be, well, with no with no Bam, I, they I just could go up. How you gonna get rebounds? If they stay focused. Mm. If 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 there's no Bam, how are you gonna get rebounds? Good question. It's hard to play, it's hard it's, to box uh, Chris, it's hard to box out in the zone because at least your man's right there. You just if you play a man to man, right. you guys right there, you just turn and box him out. But in the zone, I remember the high school coach say, we uh, find somebody that box him out. That's easy to say. The guy's at the three-point line. How yeah, you want me to run from under the basket and go box out somebody? I'm just going to go try to get the rebound. And lo and behold, here he come flying in. He gets to re get the rebound and put it back. Mm. Lakers, we're going to go ahead and do this thing because I just want to come in here. I just want to have bragging rights. Skip Bayless, who have not let me have my bragging rights, for four years on this show, all he was doing was yuckety, yuck, yuck it. Okay, D, right in his face. Boom, right in the king's face. In his backyard. Just, well, just kiki ki it. He did. Now, I'm going to get the, I want to kiki ki, -ki some. I, I have congratulated no. you for two weeks I don't want, on no, LeBron's no, no. fourth ring. No. It's over. I want to hear you say, just for the record, on this show, right here, right now, the Miami Heat are done. I no, just want to hear. They're it. not done. They they they're too well coached. You're they, they're, they're kidding. Tough. They're tough team. You know what? You see what he did? 
He won't. He don't want me to celebrate. You, super, I, you too superstitious. I'm very superstitious. You, see, you're very superstitious. It, <laughs> see, you see what the Bengals did? They knew they were going to take Joe Burrow's, uh, uh, with Joe Burrow with the first pick. But what did they do? They let him have all the pamp, the the the, the, uh, the circumstances. They let him have all that. Skip trying to take my moment away. He don't want me to enjoy this step by step. He just want to just go ahead and no, I'm not going to let you do that. They're playing the equivalent of the South Bay Lakers. No, they, the, the there, you go, see, team. there you go. That's who they're playing. You, you, Chris, you see what they're they're playing the playing the South Bay Lakers. Oh, this. Oh, he's already he's already hey, on record. You play who's in front of yes. you. Yes. Oh, you play okay. who's in front of you. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's all we Jordan deserve, ever did. We deserve one of these. Yep. So, Jordan, you're ripping Jordan for playing Malone and Stockton, and now you're saying LeBron is playing Tyler Hero? Really? But what about the what what about that super team that they had in uh, Golden State, Chris? Oh, what about what well look, the, the Spurs. Amanu I was gonna say LeBron deserves this. Yes. I mean Manu Manu he's skip, it, what he's like, Manu, the, the Tony big Parker. Three, yeah, in San Antonio. Yep. Cake walk. Golden State. Way to go. Have some yeah. cake. Even OKC. I'll get you a cake. That's Hold what on. I should get oh, you. I big old cake. You know what? I didn't yeah. even mention OKC. And it's legit. I didn't even mention OKC. He beat Russ. Right. Russ is an MVP. Mm. James Harden is an MVP. I didn't even mention them. I wouldn't even want to throw that in there. Mm. Daniel House, most improved yep. player in the league. Out. No, he's not. First of all, that award went to uh, 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 Brandon Ingram. Well, Brandon that's, Ingram. That's what Mike D'Antoni said. Skip, stop. I can't. You see this, Chris? This joker go put all that on Daniel House. It was. <laughs> the Houston Rockets season was hinged on Daniel House. It was. <sighs> really, right, Skip? Right. Yep. Okay. No way. Skip, please don't get Shannon a cake. He's not going to eat it. That's part of the superstition yeah, thing, right? Oh, I'm going to have you a big old cake for celebration. Celebrate yep. a little early. How do you play in a virtual parade, Shannon? Are you, <laughs> you thought about that? You're going to have to put a don't little Don't be surprised if you see old goat man in the virtual stands on Friday, either. <laughs> oh, don't be surprised. I've been waiting for you to make an appearance. Oh. Thank you for watching. You can subscribe here to get the latest from the show. And be sure to check out more of the best clips from Undisputed or go watch a few other segments from our other shows on FS1.